Hello everyone and welcome back to another Star Wars Galaxy Heroes video to a brand new episode of Grand Arena 5v5. Today's round is round 3 of week 3 so it is the final round of this 5v5 season. As you guys know that have been watching my videos I am 100% win record so far. Would like to try and get the 9-0 victories that I was looking for at the beginning of the season. Obviously coming back to the game again so I'm going to try and achieve that today if I can. So my opponent is going to be trying to stop me from doing this is Haku from the guild Uol Karelia and they have 11.5 million GP so about 400k less GP than me so that should be a good fight so obviously if you do enjoy it a like and comment is always much appreciated and don't forget to hit that sub button down below and let's jump straight into it okay so attacking very early on as you can see we do have some pretty tough walls to face as you could probably imagine up in cover one and um, if we can try and clear this full one shot i'd be very happy but obviously if uh, i do get a loss today i wouldn't be too disheartened because we've done pretty well this season so gonna be starting off the south side i'll very quickly show you off the north we have a and sincere there obviously and then i'm on mothma big squad that that team just screams tuscans to me <laughs> and then a dash team and a seer taran team at the bottom so pretty decent rule there now, uh, Malgus and Seer are pretty going to be tough opponents. So, we do have an Elvian layer, as you can see, a trench squad, well, a proper trench trench squad uh, with Watt in there as well. A LV with Dark Troop Moff Gideon, which I thought was quite odd. A layer and a Ray uh, with Ben and Cal, and obviously Barris in there as well. So, probably going to start off with. Let's do LV first today. I'm going to obviously, you probably guys could probably guess what I'm going to be using here. As you probably guessed, it is, uh, of course, Bane, Dooku versus LV. I'm hoping that the Dark Troop Moff Gideon here is not going to be too much of an issue, but we'll obviously see. This is a deck I'm taking, obviously taking Doubt to slow them down a little bit. So, increase their cooldowns to begin with. Then, the Strife for Stun. Nice. This will probably kill Maul. And Thrawn, which is great. Nice ability to block on Moth. Nice stuns again. Goodbye, Bane. Used to max health of Moth. Okay, Royal Guard has got deleted in the side. Didn't even notice that. Okay, and now we just got to 1v1 versus LV here. And there we go. For a 75 banner win to start. Next up, Leia, uh, Jabba versus Leia, sorry. So this is Daquan. They have protection up on the level three, which is obviously very good. Uh, tenacity, crit damage, bit of crit avoidance as well. This is obviously my Bushcron, if you wanted to have a look there. So go to confront the Thermals on R2 this time. All right, let's blow all those Thermals up. Then let's pass the turn over to Jabba. Shrug all those debuffs off. Now we will get a disarm on Captain Drogon. Throw the hat R2. Get some more thermals on Drogon. Okay, we do have a uh, contract now, which is great. This protection up has been really annoying. Wow, that was quite a lot of damage. All right, let's throw the buff immunity on Ben then. Obviously, I have to clear that with uh, Embo if we can. Don't kill him yet. Uh, yes, blow for him up. Why not? <laughs> oh, I love it. Alright, get an armor shred on Leia. Just gonna leave. Um, 
base in the back. He's not too much of a threat. then I guess right there we go kill base okay we'll just stand in the middle that's fine and we'll just put his floor to now we can just There we go, for another 65 banner win. It's, this counter is a bit of an unknown for me, I have no idea how it's going to go. Uh, Seer Taran versus Race, I'll very quickly show you Datacrons, you can pause on the screen if you wanted to have a look. Um, I'm taking a Doubtcron with me for... Uh, for Nice, I guess. That was almost com really bad timing with the wave there from um, whatever her name is, Ray, JTR that is. Oh, it's much gonna stun Ben. Maybe yeet out Barris. Very nice. Uh, he's set to survive, really. Look, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not look, liking the look at this, to be honest. Let's put this term to one, that might help us a little bit. Not using the rock throw yet. Nice dodges. Okay. Ooh. That was probably really dumb, actually. Uh, was it? Mm. Well, why are you not taking any damage? Hmm, I think it's Cal throwing Spanner in the works. Yeah, we're going to lose this, but I'll keep it without Barris there. A blap. <laughs> right, that's fine. Uh, so I think we're going to clean this up with now. Probably JML. Maybe. I don't know. Taking in uh, Leia for the cleanup. I was going to take Starkiller, but got plans to use him against the Trench team. Still slightly annoyed I didn't get that Seer Tarantine to work. I probably just did some things wrong. Um, 
but it's fine. I win everything. Right, let's get that on layer. It's definitely the uh, cow throwing a spanner in the works. All right, let's get. Well, I shouldn't have taunted actually. Yeah, that was a mistake. Oh man, stop throwing! What am I doing? I was hoping we we're just going to be able to one-shot him. That's so annoying. Right, let's keep the... The stun on Ben. There's no point doing that yet, really, is there? Well, we shouldn't die from this with her having offense down. Okay, as long as she doesn't get cleansed, I was about to say. <laughs> oh, my God. Right. Oh, we went after. Just give us a layer. Okay, there we go. Awful banners on the cleanup as well, but 37. I'll just have to deal with that. And hopefully we just get one shot and everything else. <laughs> the EP Star Killer versus Trench. I'm just thinking about that Seer Taran fight against Ray. I kind of feel like if I had taken um, Cat like it accidentally last time, we might have actually got a win there with the extra offense that he, um, she would have provided. But I guess it kind of would have only gone to Seer, so actually never mind. To ignore me. Uh, right, let's get a shock out. Why did Visus just assist? I thought she only assisted against Sith targets. That was was a, just the Sith have to be on the team. Okay. Yeah, that did no damage, Star Killer. I thought it was. Yeah, attack Sith enemies. That must be a bug. Because... Unless it's I'm missing something apart of the kit, I have no idea. I'm definitely think that's a bug though. I mean, I'll, I'll take it. <laughs> it's helping. <laughs> as long as... Uh... Good old Django takes his turns. There we go, for 65. And that does open up the back wall so we can see what's there. I'm going to presume there's going to be a Leviathan in the this zone, in the fleet zone as well. But Ooh, we've got Ewoks. Ewoks, Iden, and Finn. That looks like a very Womperable Iden team, so I'm probably going to use that there. Hmm. Let's see what we can do up in the north. <laughs> uh, nice to have you, train. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is the deck on the Momotha has. And I'm taking my Tuscan Kronk because obviously about to expire. So I took Tuscans off defense for this last round to obviously try and use them. Definitely going to be using Jawas in this round as well. Uh, I don't know what, what team we're going to take them up against, but. Uh, she hit Bigs. Boom. Oh, okay. Oh, Doc's killed him. That's fine. Come on. Got to go for Kyle next. I mean, Momo's going to revive someone. But they'll all get stunned again. 
Yes, very nice. That's because obviously they're attacking someone with 10 stacks of momentum, so we'll get stunned. Because every a turn they do is always a mass assist. They're always guaranteed to get stuns as long as you have 10 stacks, so. Uh, <laughs> double dodge. Come on. Very nice. Uh, let's actually... The big hit on Kyle. Let's keep the protection up, obviously, for banners if we can. Yes, well done. Come on, Bistan, just die already. Oh my god. There we go. For a 65 banner win. Very nice. Now taking Sith Empire versus this uh, Seer crew team. So. Should be okay, I'm hoping. Get that tenacity up on Malgus. I will show you Dave Kron quickly. I don't have any doubt on me. I've got offense, I think. Show you their one. They've got extra offense uh, and obviously inflicting doubt as well. Then I'm just taking extra offense, stacking with buffs, basically. That's right, goodbye to Taron. Let's hit that shock at the back. The shock on everyone else. Obviously from, I believe that's from the Omicron, actually. Go after Seer now, because I'm worried about her yeet. Need to try and get an ability to block on her. If we can, which we do, which is great. And I get the fear on everyone else. That's brilliant. Go. Done crew. Dunk on you. Don't know why I drain, that's pretty pointless against crew, but it's fine. Doors out a little bit longer, I suppose. 64 banners. Oh 63. Okay, we're missing another banner, but that will do. Okay, seeing what versus, versus Malgus. Just playing it a little bit safe, obviously, because I would like to try and get as many banners as possible. And Jedi can go wrong against this and get worse banners than this would, so. Thought this was a better pick of the two. Probably would have taken Jedi had I not lost against Rey. Fine. We always knew what was going to die. Everyone's got deceived, which is great. All right, ultimate. Then we just go for a big zap. If uh, Malgus doesn't re reduce my cooldowns, that is. <laughs> uh, or increase my cooldowns, I should say. Not reduce. All right, here we go. Goodbye. Kill Talon off. I was going to hit uh, Malik and then we'll just go into ultimate again. Do, 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 do. Yes, well done, see, you can relink, but there's not really much point, to be honest.
and zap. There we go. Dixie five. An SOKR with two past the turn people against Dash. And this isn't a Honda one, so I wasn't too worried about them going first, which is good. Uh, now I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to stun Dash. And I'm actually going to pass the turn over again. And then do a swipe. And everyone's dead. Four at 67. Oh, that does mean we opened up fleets as well. I did think about that. Uh, let's have a look what we have. I guess we have... Yeah. <laughs> oh, why? I don't want to face a Leviathan. Oh, and it's an attacking lineup exec as well. Oh, it is the Sith Marauder. Sith uh, Dorito. Sith Fighter is what I was going to say. Sith Fighter? No. This Trooper. Get it right. <laughs> right, there we go. Uh, that's the fleet save, but we're obviously going to continue down in the south and get those teams out of the way. Need to use... Uh, Afra need to use Jawas, and I think that's the only Datacons from the set that's about to expire, so I'll probably use them and plus some other one. Wumper, probably. All right, Wumps versus Iden. <laughs> Bye, Snow Trooper. Yeah, you're a bit late with that, Iden, unfortunately. I haven't done this in a while, so I'm not putting this to full auto. Okay, I'm not liking to look at this, to be fair. I'm just taking way too many turns. And that short trooper is not taking any damage. Wow, okay. Doing a lot of damage as well for Relic 8. Then watch her do her anti revive, uh, her revive thing next go. Watch. Oh, she's not gonna take a turn. I swear to God, please. Thank you. We're <laughs> <For> 68. <laughs> <laughs> Afro versus this Finn Zori team. I don't believe Zori has the Omicron. Uh, they do inflict damage when they do debuffs to us, which could be quite annoying for banners. Um, but hopefully, we can keep them under control. Let's kill Resistance Hero Finn first. He's out of here. Get uh, Zori out of stealth. Kill her. And finish for Max Banners. Last fight of uh this ground zone in grand arena and obviously probably the last fight i'm actually going to be using proper well good jawa squad basically on scav <laughs> nice low gray <laughs> I still can't believe it. Relic 5 or whatever I've got them at. They're only hitting for 10k on a gear 12 Ewok. That's pretty embarrassing. But yeah, Max Banners and now we can move on to feats where hopefully my Chimera counter goes right against Leviathan. Please. Come on. Come on, please. Why is it on one times?
Oh, that was close. Wrong person. Need tide defender. Nice stun. Okay, there we go. Very nice. Uh, does this, any of them actually give Snasty up? Let's do that. Stop, stop, stop. Thank you. Call in interceptor. Oh my god, my heart is racing so fast right now. Uh oh. Yes. Come on. Yes, finally, finally. It's only taken me nine grand arena rounds to get a Chimera versus Leviathan. Well, I mean, we've not faced it twice, but I mean, still, that's so annoying, but finally got a win. It's a shame I've already dropped against Ray. <laughs> but yes, I'm very happy with that. We did get another drop that I was expecting. So uh, let's go on to the next fleets. Okay, Banity versus Executor, Executor, whatever. Nice crit damage down, that's great. Of course you get the double tap. No, 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 please. Oh no, and I've got ability block. No. No. Please, 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 please don't mess up. Come on. Right. I'm going to go for Boba. Oh, I don't like this. I'm calling in Ghost. Ghost is coming in. There we go. Right. Here we got the ability to block Sansom Assist, which is good. Oh my god, Sanity Blood! Stop! 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 Right. Good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh. I knew that's my career fight went away well something was gonna go wrong in ships. I didn't think it was gonna be this fight. <laughs> 68 again, that's awful. Please can we get a good banners with the exec versus negotiator? Okay, straight on Anakin. Okay, I was kind of hoping that uh, Anakin was going to be out of start. Oh, here we go. All right.
Let's call him Boba. We can kill off Anakin. Mm, bit too late, blow. Let's get to contract. We do. That's great. All right. Uh, I'm not going to do that, actually. We'll save the heal for near the end. For that very reason. Okay, that was a waste. I didn't realize everyone had but that's fine. You can call in Razor Crest now. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's kill Marauder once because he's going to AWE afterwards. Because now we should be able to heal now. Let's go heal up his energy blood. Hit the AWE. Bye to you. Then that should be. I don't know. 72 banners, I guess. 70. Yeah, 72, I'm going to say. I mean, I could be wrong. Oh, 73. Okay. Oh, that was a stressful fleet. And I still can't believe we dropped against Ray. I mean, I'm just going to have to avoid using that team against uh, Cal counters. I mean, we're probably not going to be able to use that for quite a while, obviously, with the Ray and Resistance crumbs that have come back around. Um, because Ray does look like she's going to be pretty nuts going forward. So, going to be interesting. So. 72 banners, I think that's going to be 1830 something. Well, we've left the, <laughs> the win on the board there for my opponent. If they could full clear me, um, well, even, I think even if they just drop a fight and then full clear me after that, uh, as long as they're good with their banners, they should be okay for a uh, obviously a victory here. So we'll obviously let's see how we get on later on once my opponent does their attacks. So until then, I shall catch you in a bit. Okay, so I'm back later on. As you can see, I did manage to pull off my 100% win record this season, which is obviously great. That does mean we've lined ourselves up pretty nicely for uh, bringing the wheel back, obviously, the first round of the next 3v3 season. My opponent just decided to do one attack and then call it quits, which I guess is kind of makes more sense if you're planning on maximizing your amount of crystals that you want. Um, if you think you're going to go into a tougher bracket, obviously, and losing a lot, yeah, sometimes it just makes sense to lose one obviously because we're in kyber one and we would have stayed in kyber one regardless of this result uh, they might have just decided that uh, they dropped down a bracket things might be a bit easier than they can get more crystals obviously when 3v3 comes around that's kind of the logic i thought they were going with maybe i could be wrong um but funny enough the team that they chose to fight was of course uh my ray team which was the only team that i dropped on on their wall so that's obviously going to be it for this Grand Arena season. I do hope you enjoyed the content and I hope you look forward to the wheel comeback. So if you have, obviously, thank you very much for watching and I shall catch you in the next one.